In this video, we write a C program to print the following series up to n and also we find their sum using while loop. This is the series we want to print 1, minus 2, plus 3, minus 4 and so on up to n. We want to print this series as well as we want to find out their sum also. For this purpose, we have taken one looping variable i is equal to 1 and n to read out n value and then we have initialized we have taken some variable and initialized with the 0 and then we are reading n value and these things are similar to the previous program initially we are printing i value and then we are adding i to sum and then we are incrementing i value and later onwards now we write the while loop code y i is less than or is equal to n now observe here in the series uh, first of all we have printed 1 and then later we need to decide whether to print minus or to plus before a number. In the while loop the series is starting from 2 that means if the given number is even number then we need to print minus before that number. If the number is odd number then we need to pr print plus before in front of that particular number. Now the logic here is in the while loop if i value is even number then we print minus in front of that particular i value. If i value is odd number then we print plus in front of that particular i value. Now this is the logic here. In the condition we write if i mod 2 is equal to 0 that means if i value is an even number then we print printf then we attach minus before that particular number minus percentage d i value and also in the sum calculation we, we perform sum is equal to sum minus i otherwise if i value is odd number then we attach printf we attach plus before that particular i value comma i and then we perform plus operation, addition operation, sum is equal to sum plus i and then we increment i value and after while loop is completed, we print print sum of series is equal to percentage d sum. This is a simple program. Now we run this program. Now this is the simple program. Now we run this. That is why I am giving 10. We are getting the series 1 minus 2 plus 3 minus 4 and so on up to minus 10. And sum of the series is equal to minus 5. Now let us give another input. That is I am giving 5 and sum of the series is equal to 3. And now I analyze this particular program. Now initially i value is 1 and sum value is sum value is 0 and n value is 5 and uh, first of all we are printing i value that is now i value becomes here I am writing the series i value becomes 1 uh, i value is printed then sum is equal to sum plus i sum plus i means 0 plus i value 1 0 plus 1 1 sum value becomes 1 then we are printing, sorry, then we are performing i plus plus. Sir. Now i value becomes uh, 2. Then we are entering into while loop. In the while loop, we are checking condition. While i is less than or is equal to n, i value is 2, 
2 is less than or is equal to 5 which is correct 2 is less than or is equal to 5 then we enter into while loop in the while loop we check condition if i mod 2 is equal to 0 i value is 2 2 mod 2 2 mod 2 means this condition is true that means i is even number then we print the series minus i value percentage d i i value is 2 then we are performing sum is equal to sum minus i sum minus i means sum value is 1 i value is 2 1 minus 2 that means sum value now gets value minus 1 1 minus 2 means minus 1 then we, we get to this particular statement i plus plus now i value becomes a 3 again we enter into while loop condition part i less than or is equal to n again 3 less than or is equal to 5 which is correct again again we enter into while loop we check condition if i mod 2 is equal to 0 3 mod 2 means that means 3 is not divisible by 2 that means we enter into else part that means we enter into else part in else part we print print f plus and then we print i value what is i value 3 then i value becomes i plus plus i value becomes 4 then again we enter into while loop condition again 4 is less than or is equal to 5 which is correct then we enter into while loop again we check condition i mod 2 is equal to 0 so 4 mod 2 is equal to 0 why because 4 is an even number then we print minus i value that is 4 Sorry, in the previous case, in, when i value becomes uh, plus, we, have, we didn't add some value here. What is some value in, in the previous case? Uh, minus 1 plus 3. Minus 1 plus 3 means some value becomes uh, 2. Okay, now coming to i value 4 case. Uh, when i value is 2, then we are printing minus 4 and then sum is equal to sum minus i. Sum minus i means 2 minus 4 that is minus 2. Now i plus plus. Now i value becomes a uh, 5 again 5 is less than or is equal to 5 which is correct then we get again we enter into while loop then we check condition i mod 2 is equal to 0 so 5 is not divisible by 2 then we enter into else part in the else part we are printing plus 5 and then sum is equal to sum plus i sum value is minus 2 minus 2 plus 5 now sum value gets a 3 then i plus plus i value becomes a 6 but when the condition is checked in the while loop 6 is less than or is equal to 5 which is incorrect which is false that means while loop is stopped and then we are printing sum of the series is equal to what is the sum value 3 sum of the series is equal to 3 in this fashion we can write a c program to print the given series as well as to find out its particular sum